One eerie night in Bikini Bottom, SpongeBob was just getting ready for bed. <sighs> what a long day. Well, good night, Gare Bear. Meow. He was about to fall asleep when he heard a strange voice. SpongeBob. Ah! What was that? He quickly got up to investigate. He walked downstairs to see where the voice was coming from. Hello? Is anyone there? Then he heard the voice again. SpongeBob. Who's there? I have a lot of talents that you don't know about. Oh, on, on the, the contrary, contrary, SpongeBob. SpongeBob looked behind him and gasped. There in front of him was a leopard-like creature. I know all your secrets and desires, because of course, I am you. <gasps> that voice! He sounds like me! I despise you, Spongebob, and for that reason, you must be eliminated. But don't worry, it'll be over soon. And the creature leaped forward at Spongebob. Spongebob dodged the attack and he quickly made a run for it. Running, are we? This should be fun. SpongeBob ran for dear life trying to escape the creature. Get back here, SquarePants! But SpongeBob kept running. SquarePants! He climbed up a cliff. You think a cliff will stop me? I'll chase you to the ends of the earth! The creature eventually cornered him. I've got you now, SpongeBob. But as the creature lunged at him, Sandy quickly intervened and sent the creature flying. Ah, Sandy Cheeks, you're just in time. Holy shrimp, its voice changed! It sounds like me! No matter, I will eliminate both of you. And the creature lunged at the duo. SpongeBob and Sandy tried to hold the creature off but the creature was too fast. What is this thing? I don't know, but whatever it is, it's a pretty quick critter. Then something stunned the leopard. SpongeBob and Sandy looked over. It was Squidward and Mr. Krabs. Why don't you pick on somebody your own size? Yeah, why don't you go back to the depths of hell where you belong, Cretan? Arr, this just keeps getting better and better. Sweet Davy Jones, that voice sounds like me. And I will have you all for lunch. Me too! Then Plankton arrived with a bazooka. Eat this, you no-good lunatic. The missile sent the creature in a daze. <sighs> Enough! You may have won this round, but I'll get the Krabby Patty secret formula yet! <laughs> and the creature retreated. Hey, how dare you mimic my voice! The Mimic? That's a good name for it. I agree. The name fits. I'm gonna go back home and do some research on this thing. I might as well go back home as well and do some research. Then Patrick woke up and came out of his house. Hey guys, what did I miss? Nothing now, buddy. Nothing now. Unknown to them, the creature was watching them from afar. Oh, don't worry, Patrick. You'll find out soon enough. 